lot of you are hearing that acetaminophen and Tylenol are bad, but we really don't know why. So let me break it down why it's bad. And we've known this for a really long time. It's just our public health policy in the United States is absolute garbage. So this guy is exactly why we have so much misinformation online. He's pretending to be a medical doctor, especially with a surgical scrub cap, but he's not. He's not a medical doctor. Here you can see he's trying to explain some science behind his outrageous claim which to the average person sounds absolutely plausible. But I actually posted on his post. I've mentioned why his science is wrong and he has not replied once. What he's talking about is overdose levels of acetaminophen and at therapeutic doses, this does not occur. And then he talks about how the brain can have inflammation, but none of this is supported by direct evidence. I even put in a follow-up comment. Again, he did not reply. And again, I've mentioned all of my sources. He does not mention one source. This should be a cautionary tale for everyone. People online who pretend to be someone else, especially reputable medical doctors online, will hide their identity and they will sell you a product. They will give you misinformation through science that sounds very familiar or science that sounds correct, but ultimately they're misleading you.